Christine Montgomery, uh, Barbara Ben Oliel, and I'm a Jewish mother, and my, our child is the most beautiful. <laughs> I'm Teresa Gomes. Antonio Ordaneta. You should have been last because you saved the best for last. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, what we came up with as an idea on our storyboard is uh, to tune in to Divorce TV. We wanted to add one more reality show TV uh, show to the television, and this would be uh, Divorce Do Us Part. So similar concept to Deck Do Us Part, uh, the Nanny Show, but the whole purpose of this episode is we're going to have one family per episode, and it's going to be an actual, we would choose actors because we want to keep confidentiality, but it's going to be an actual real case. So we're actually using real family situations and scenarios, and we would have a support team. And it, these we gave examples, lawyer, media, counselor, financial advisor, religious people, social worker, psychologist, but it could be unlimited based on the person's, uh, their family situation and how they're going through it because we want to make it multicultural, we want to make it diverse for those people so the support team may change. And from there, we would have a host, which we're going to call a divorce coach. They're going to be the ones that are going to be coaching this family to go throughout the whole process. Uh, we said we'd want two people, male and female, because we didn't want the female to complain if it was a male, and we didn't want the male to complain if it was a woman. So they're going to get two. <laughs> um, the purpose of the episode is for it to be informational. So it's going to give you fast and accurate information. So these people, the lawyers, mediators, they're going to actually be giving out information to coach people about the law and specific situations that they can actually use in a practicality, uh, practical way. It's also going to be very cost efficient because there's going to be lots of advertising and reality TV makes a lot of money and especially when it's about things breaking up or not going right so we know that divorce situations would bring in a lot of money these people who are actually part of the support team or different law firms or whatever could be used in advertising on this actual show so that could pay for the program in itself where the users don't have to worry or the families don't have to worry about how much it's actually going to cost them being a part of the show, the show would actually pay for the cost of their divorce. Oh. Right? And that would be their incentive to want to be a part of it. And then we were thinking at the end of the episode is to kind of give a recap of that particular case and the scenario and the results of the cost it actually took for this real family to get their divorce, the time it took them to do it so people could see different situations and the resolution that they came up with if they actually came up with one throughout that episode and we can do recap episodes with these families afterwards to see continuous progress and then uh, Antonio still wants to cruise, divorce cruise, so we figure all the families should go on a divorce cruise at the end of the show. <laughs>